Earlier this month, the U.S. Supreme Court ruled straight ticket voting in Michigan will be allowed for the November election. Basically, that decision means voters can submit the partisan section of the ballot three ways. As a straight ticket, voting for all candidates in one party, a split ticket, voting a straight ticket and for individual candidates of your choice, or a mixed ticket, where you vote for individual candidates of your choice in each office. With the option to vote on both sides of the ballot, clerks expect a higher turnout. They hope those who aren't registered now will see them by the deadline, October 11th. They can only vote Democrat or Republican in August. They don't like to come out, it seems like, because we only had a 28% turnout. Normally in November at the general election, because they do have an opportunity to vote both sides of the ballot, they seem to like that, and I get about a 65% turnout. One thing to note, you still need to mark your ballot for the nonpartisan and proposal sections of the ballot, which may be on a second page. If you want to know more about this, visit our website at UpperMichiganSource.com.